A car is driving at 90 kilometers per hour. How far in meters does it travel in three seconds? So to answer this question, we'll first convert 90 kilometers per hour into meters per second, then determine the distance traveled in three seconds. To do this conversion, we'll use unit fractions. So we'll begin by writing 90 kilometers per hour as a fraction, which would be 90 kilometers per one hour. And our goal here is to convert this rate into a rate where we have meters per second. Let's begin by converting the kilometers to meters. We'll do this using the conversion that one kilometer equals 1,000 meters. So we're gonna multiply by a unit fraction, and because we want kilometers to simplify out, we'll put kilometers in the denominator and meters in the numerator. And again, the conversion is that 1,000 meters equals one kilometer. Because these units are equal, this fraction is equal to one, but notice how the units of kilometers now simplifies out, leaving us with meters. Now we still have to convert hours to seconds, so we'll first convert hours to minutes by multiplying by another unit fraction. We don't want hours in our answer, so we'll have to have hours in the numerator and minutes in the denominator. And the conversion is that one hour equals 60 minutes, so we'll have one hour over 60 minutes. Notice now the units of hours simplifies out, and now we're left to convert minutes to seconds. So we multiply by another unit fraction. We want minutes to simplify out, so we'll have minutes in the numerator and seconds in the denominator, and our conversion is that one minute equals 60 seconds. Minutes simplifies out. Notice how now we have the correct units. So now we'll multiply across the numerator, multiply across the denominator, and then divide to get the unit rate. So in the numerator we have 90 times 1,000 times one times one, that's 90,000 meters. In our denominator we have one times one times 60 times 60 seconds, or 3,600 seconds. Again, we'll now convert this to a unit rate by performing this division. So 90,000 divided by 3,600 is equal to 25, which means a unit rate is 25 meters per one second, which can also be written as 25 meters per second. But our goal here is to find the distance traveled in three seconds, where distance equals rate times time. So the distance traveled is equal to 25 meters per second times the time of three seconds, which gives us 75 meters. A lot of times when working with the distance formula, we leave the units off like we did here, and then just put the units in our answer. But I do want to show this again, leaving the units in. We could have written this as the distance equals the rate of 25 meters per one second times a time of three seconds, which could be written as three seconds over one. Notice how in this form, the units of seconds simplifies out, leaving us with the same result of 75 meters. So one thing nice about leaving the units in is that we never have to second guess ourselves about what the units should be because the units work themselves out. I hope you found this explanation helpful.